they found through research is that food and beverage marketing, first of all, has a huge impact on children. It has an impact on their food preferences, so um, kids prefer to eat foods that they've seen advertised. It has an impact on um, their food intake, so they're actually going to choose to eat foods that they see advertised more frequently. It also has an impact on the foods that they ask parents to buy, and typically kids are asking for foods that they've seen advertised to them. Go to the grocery store my children would want to buy um, a cartoon character package not necessarily because of what the food was but what the packaging was that that was shocking to me kids are seeing a very high volume of food and beverage marketing online on their favorite websites um, and the majority of this advertising is very very unhealthy over 90 percent of the ads were actually um, categorized as unhealthy it's online, certainly. It's in, in the schools, in the schoolyards, in recreation centers, on billboards, in hospitals. Basically, in any location where children gather, there's going to be marketing that is targeted at children unless it's been restricted. really, really important to um, give parents a helping hand. Having regulations on food and beverage marketing is one way to support parents. Yeah.